What's going on, YouTube? KPhil98, back on the Royal Comics channel. Welcome to Season 2 of the Royal Comics Show. Now, Season 2 came kind of early, close to Season 1, because of, um, I didn't expect to see Lone Ranger when I did. So, yeah, a Lone Ranger review. Now, Lone Ranger stars Johnny Depp and Army Hammer, and you, if you've seen the trailer, then you know what I'm talking about. Johnny Depp is Tonto... And Army Hammer is the Lone Ranger. And, um, you, you practically can tell where the story goes from there. Um, if you've, like, read the, the, the plot or something. Or you watch the trailer, at least. Um, you know he, um, he's apparently died. Or, um, they think that, uh, John Reed, Army Hammer's character, had died, but... No, Tonto had like saved him and stuff. Yeah, that's basically the story. Now, the storytelling wasn't all that bad. Um, it really wasn't that bad. Most people, most most critics did not really like this movie. Um, and you'll get a lot from me. You get a lot of that from me for like any movie. Is that, that most people didn't like it, but I did so. I thought this movie was was really entertaining. I was really entertained by this movie. Um, I had a few problems with it, but all in all, it was it was it was pretty good. I I enjoyed it. It was it was fun. Now some of the parts that I actually had a few problems with was like nothing but um like really like far fetched, not even realistic. Um, not even realistic looking whatsoever. They um just kinda threw that in there to have a little fun, like like there's a scene like the opening scene one of the opening scenes to the Lone Rangers he gets on a bus and he gets high or not a bus, a train and he gets hijacked. And then like the train does like all these flips and stuff and brakes and stuff like that. And then Johnny Depp and Army Hammer do like these somersaults and stuff. Just doesn't even look that right. Just, just it looks CGI. And there was a few other CGI parts in that movie, but like you can obviously tell it was CGI. But to the naked eye, it would have been just fine. So yeah, that's that's what's going on. Um. Also. Um. The story, the story, um, I don't know, like, the, the, the Comanche parts with, um, Tonto felt kind of racist to me, to be honest with you, yeah, it did feel a tad bit racist, like, a racial stereotype to, like, all Indians just dance around fire, and they're just savages, it's just, it's just a tad bit racist to me, but, like, I'm not gonna deny that they didn't do what they did, did their rituals and stuff like that, but... It's a tad bit racist. <laughs> and, um... Uh, I'm gonna stop... I'm gonna stop talking about, like, how bad this movie did. Or not how bad, but, like... Like, all the flaws in this movie. And I'm gonna start... I'm gonna start talking about, like, the good parts of the movie. And then, until I can think of, um... Uh, another bad part. <laughs> I'm, I'm not trying to pick apart this movie. I did really enjoy this movie, but... Um, yeah. <laughs> so, th this movie, all in all, had really good action sequences, I felt. They, they were they were really interesting. They were really cool to see. The characters, some of them were relatable. If, like, I don't know, you, you kind of felt you related to them that way. Um, stuff like that. Um, the Tonto, to me, was actually relatable. Really relatable, because... If, um, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying not to spoil anything here, but, um, he did something to, um, his backstory is, like, really, really, like, um, it's just really deep and personal, and it was a bit stupid on his part to do what he did, or to have his, to have, to have the antagonist come in there to do what they did, so it felt kind of relatable, because I have those stupid moments where I do something really foolish, stuff like that. So in a way, Tonto was um, uh, really relatable to me. Not just that I'm Indian, but he was really relatable in a way. Stuff like that. 
Also, Army Hammer, um, John Reed, the Lone Ranger, was sort of relatable to. Like, you have that brother that is just above you, and everyone just looks up to him, and you just... Everyone looks up to him, and they're trying to compare you to him. Anybody that they have, like, a conflict with, they compare you to him. So, that's, that's Army Hammer. That's her, um, the Lone Ranger is basically uh, how he's relatable. I was going to sit here and, like, um, say some good stuff about it until I found something to pick up, or to, to um, say, uh, like, I wouldn't say bad, but, like, bit flaws in the movie, but I just haven't really found a flaw, except for the stuff I mentioned. Some of the action sequences, yeah, I already said, yeah, they were a bit CGI, and, um, I did really enjoy how they put the when a when a day when a dingo when a da, ba, when a bago when when a dingo when dingo that's how it is when dingo because um I grew up listening to like some legends about when dingo which is like um which is basically a cannibal if um you haven't seen the movie stuff like that and so yeah the Lone Ranger um have you seen it um do you plan on seeing it actually. I actually uh, recommend seeing this. It wasn't it wasn't bad, but it wasn't just all that good. It, it, the best uh, the best movie of the summer, uh, no. The worst movie, and far from it. <laughs> and so yeah, that's uh, the Lone Ranger. Um, the Lone Ranger, uh, three out of five. It is a really it's a good movie. But it's one of those movies you can only see once. Do you know? Do you, you understand what I'm talking about? It's one of those movies you can only see once. Like, like you go to watch it again and you're just like, yeah, well, I'm, I just can't. It's, that's basically the only way I can describe it, without like saying it was terrible. It wasn't terrible. So that's, that's what I'm trying to get at. So, Lone, Lone Ranger, three out of three out of five. I I recommend watch, seeing it, but if like if. I don't recommend going out of your way just to see Lone Ranger. You can go see Pacific Rim. Um, you can go see... I haven't seen Pacific Rim yet, but if I do, you can expect a review coming from that. You can um, go see Turbo. Is that opening this week? Pretty sure. Turbo is opening this week. Um, a bunch of other stuff. So yeah, you can go check us out if you want to. It's, it's, it's pretty good. I, I, I believe it. So yeah. Uh, that's, that's it for now, and um, looking forward to season two, Royal Comic Show. I'm out.